In this session, we will have an example on list comprehension. Take two list of same length as an input and return a dictionary with one list as key and another list as value. So to understand list comprehension better, first we will write code using normal for loop and then we will write using list comprehension. Let's start. Def it takes two inputs keys values now define our final dictionary which we are going to return for i in range we are going to get length of any one of the list since uh, both lists are same in size we'll just take keys then we'll add key values into the dictionaries so now keys of i equal to values i <coughs> so now we have added two lists into key values to the dictionary and return it return d so now let's prepare input keys will be numbers from 1 to 5 1 2 3 4 5 our values are numbers in string format now 1 2 3 4 and 5 so now let's make a call with inputs when you run it these two lists has been converted to dictionaries now let's write the same code using list comprehension Dave. The inputs are keys and values. Return the difference here. It's going to be dictionary comprehension. So rather than using square braces, we are using curly braces here. Now keys i colon values i for i in range length of keys so now this is a dictionary comprehension method make use of the same inputs change the method and see the result result is same you can notice the difference in how we implemented using list comprehension techniques here thanks for watching please please subscribe to the channel